I am Mad Morph and welcome to the video. This is Blue Wednesday. Let me know in a comment if you could play any instrument well, which instrument would you play? Because this is a game about jazz and finding love. Ah, uh, sleeping. We're following our dreams to play piano and having a panic attack or two on the way. Spring. Hit like and subscribe for more indie gaming playthroughs and previews and enjoy. This should be a nice, cozy and relaxing story game. Oh, I don't want to get out of bed. Who does? Guess it's going to be the same old today. Play an old upright piano with sticky keys till noon. Toss on my band hoodie that smells like mold. Then go to work at the supermarket where I get to greet all the most annoying people of Evan City. I'm telling you this paint isn't a hair dye. I can't give you a refund for toilet paper you've already used because it's rough on your tush, okay? What a nightmare. Might as well play the piano. No. Adventures of Human Ginger Sherb. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oops. Why so many rhythm games coming out recently? Oh. It's like expert mode. It's fine, it's jazz, you can't get it wrong. So I have to tell you not to play the piano in the morning. Sure, sure, sorry. I'm telling you. I'll trash that goddamn piano if you keep it up. I see. I'll be careful. <laughs> oh, that nasty old man. Why is his hearing so good anyway? What should I listen to? That's my alarm. It's already time to go. I guess I gotta get ready. Why is the bathroom so dirty? Gotta clean more. Should I shower? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I gotta go. Let me just run a bubble bath. Oh, I put the temperature right up. There we go. Oh, too hot, too hot, too hot. Oh, a bit cold. In the, oh, just right. There you go. I'm so, so excited to go to work today again. Probably an arrhythmia or something. Let's get going. What is this? A person's room or a pigsty? I'll clean up tomorrow. A bike. Who puts a bike in a place like this? It's begging to be stolen. Ben's Bakery. You guys want anything from the bakery? 
And some donuts. I can just go into shops. Hello, can I help you find something? Something that'll make me look like a musician. A musician? What kind of music? Heavy metal. I don't think we have anything like that. Oh, okay. Jazz, then. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Does that cat work here? Amathia. Putting up a bulletin board in the middle of the city. What were they thinking? Probably someone bored at City Hall had this bright idea. Be covered in porn ads before you know it. What? Look, there's even some already. He, what? Coin boost. Do people fall for this stuff? Rocket shop shooping. This looks promising. Hair salon. Can I get a new hairstyle? Oh. The waffles here are really good. They're super fluffy and have tons of Nutella. They're good, but I feel like they'll make me fat if I keep eating them. Yeah, my ex-husband didn't like these. I thought you were like 12. Huh? Never mind. <laughs> it's literally two children. Oh, books. Let's see what's new. Poverty is psychosis in the 21st century. Writing habits of the rich. Metaverse revolution. Record store. Music shop. Where do I work, though? Didn't he say supermarket or something? Oh, look. A pianist can't pass up a piano on the street. out of tune. It's not my fault. Are oh, you on your way to work today too, Morris? Hey, Alex. Yeah, I'm on my way to work. Are you on your way somewhere? Nah, I'm just hanging out here. I went to this weird bar called Flamingo Bar. It's pretty new, but I don't think it will last long. There were pink plastic flamingos at all the tables, and all the drinks were pink cocktails. It's a weird theme. How dare you. And all the food they had was chicken. It's pretty cool. Didn't taste good, though. Uh, don't you have to hurry to work? Yeah, I'll see you again. Cool. I wanted to share my flamingo bar story with someone. <laughs> Bye. Alright. Cool story. Smells like stale water. Honey bear. Found the bear. The bear for the day. I bet this is where I work. Morris, you're late again. Are you always going to be late? I'm sorry, I, I ran into a big problem on my way. What? Alien invasion? Exactly. Morris. Never mind, forget about it. Sorry, I'll go get changed. I have to clean the floor. I'm selling an eight-year-old used freezer. Should I just throw it out? Why are you standing here? Monitoring you. Doesn't look like you're working hard. I'll do better. <laughs> Sorry, boss. I was taking a bubble bath. Literally, yeah. Why are you late, 
bubble bath. How do I clean the floor? Oh, oh, scanning mini game. Yo, this is like a pretty like cartoony life sim or something. Cheese, huh? Totally judging. Wine, cheese, oil, beer. It's a party. Bread, milk, tomato sauce? What is that? And a rubber duck? Sir, what are you planning here? I don't know what that is. Bananas, a baguette, some noodles. Shoes. Alright. Weird haul. I guess I arrange these. Oh, it's like a slide puzzle or something. Right. Wait, wait. A bug as they pronounce it. Uh, I feel like I've turned into a barcode scanning robot. I think living like a robot works for me. I have to take, organize the inventory. So not much point, not much to put away. Time to go home. Well, that was an easy, easy day of work, wasn't it? at the night time only had one customer today thinking about all the jazz tunes in my head i'm gonna play it's a musical yeah, I'll say it. Oh. hello tune the static in my mind was thinking about the music in his head. How do I get that one? Jazz Club. Aunt. Hello, Morris. Aunt Marie, how have you been? I'm calling about the rent. You haven't paid it yet. If you can't pay this month's rent either, you're gonna have to leave. Six months is a long time to not pay rent. Don't you agree? Uh, I can pay this month. I got a job. Are you finally giving up that silly music? For now. Good thinking. Stop dreaming of being some sort of star. Do something useful. You have to make something of yourself, don't you think? Yeah, I'll figure it out. Bye. <sighs> I'm exhausted. It's already been a month since I started working at the supermarket. I'll be able to pay my late rent when I get paid. Temporary contract work with not a lot of pay, but still, isn't it nice to have a job? This is what I wanted. This kind of stability. This feeling of accomplishment. It's really nice to have some sort of comfort. 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 So finding comfort in this kind of thing, that's what it's come to. Where did it all go wrong? Pretty sure I want, wasn't this big a loser. <laughs> See what this is called, Blue Wednesday now. I just didn't have what it takes. Or... 
Maybe I was unlucky. All hope comes with responsibility. I'm simply paying the price for dreaming big. Got to admit, my dream was bigger than I could handle. If I could have been satisfied living gig to gig, would things be better? No, I would have ended up messing it all up anyway. Just like I did my life! My life, 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 life. What am I even doing? Might as well cut a bed. I think you're revenge procrastinating. Revenge late staying up there, young man. Yes. This kid definitely watches Whiplash like once a month. <sighs> no. I wish the apocalypse would happen. <laughs> ah, tag yourself so I wouldn't have to go to work. Testing, testing. This is an announcement from Evan City. A giant meteor is headed straight for the city. All citizens should say their prayers and prepare to die. Well, that's not going to happen. Let's get up. I mean, that's no fun. At least have, you know, some sort of zombie apocalypse before. All of that stuff. Maybe I should skip practice. This is what I live for. Just a little. What should I play? Hmm. Do it. The timing is like slightly off. I like how it all fades away, and he's got like a little drummer and stuff in his head. Hmm. Who's the kid that plays the piano in uh, Snoopy? That's what we look like over there. Little solo there for you. Hope that guy doesn't bang the door again. <sighs> Reminds me of old times. The toilet? I'd spend a whole hour in the bathroom back in school so I'd have to sit through class. Oh. Ended up getting hemorrhoids. That sucks. <laughs> Alright, kid. How old's this person? Should I shower right now? Um, let's see what else is in here. Brushed your teeth. Now I look like a castaway who had a shower a day ago. Better than yesterday. Gotta hurry up and go after I get washed. Oh, okay. It was hiding in the school. I got a hemorrhoid. Uh, uh, just right. Mm -hmm. Time to clean up. <gasps> I'm sorting my life out, dude. All right, out the door. Off to work. Mm -hmm. Should I take the bus today? Uh, sure. Why not? Ooh. 
Linus. Yeah, Linus with the blankie. A musician? I wonder what's going to happen here. I'm not late again, am I? Do you know what time it is? No. You know you're late, right? Like 10 minutes, right? 50 minutes. You, you gotta start showering and not take a bath. I was supposed to leave early for my girlfriend's birthday, but now it looks like I'm gonna be single because of you. Sorry. <laughs> oh dear. I really don't want to work. The simple labor that has no sense of accomplishment offers no growth, no satisfaction. What did you say? I was just talking to myself. Hello. Let's see what you got. What you what you shopping? What you got here? Some potato crisps. Lovely. Some meat. Soup. I'm gonna call that soup. McClackers. Bananas, sure. Baguette, very popular. Wee oui, wee. Oui. Tomato paste. Some cookies. Symbol playing monkey. What is this? The generation game? We got some beer, a robot. A cat. <laughs> oh, yeah, Smash a Kalakas, that's what I said. He's a genius. Today was another rough one. Morris, do you have a moment? I'm getting fired, aren't I? Yes, manager. We need to talk. <laughs> Imagine working somewhere for a month and still just calling them manager. You probably know what this is about. Am I getting a promotion? You really have no clue, do you? Morris, how long have you been working here? Probably a month. Yes, a total of 24 days. And how many times have you been late for work? Yesterday and today? Twice? Eight times. And how many times did you skip organizing inventory before close? Once yesterday? 12 times. Morris, at the very least, you shouldn't cause trouble for your co-workers. I'll do my- I'll do better, starting tomorrow. Don't worry about it. Excuse me? I'm saying... You're fired. Please change and leave. If you just give me another chance, Morris... I've already gave you many chances. You're the only one who didn't see that. I've already discussed it with the other employees. I'm going to give you some advice. As an adult, try and do your best at your next job. Ow. It's okay, it's okay, Morris. This is exactly the pain that you need for your art. You'll be fine, darling. Well, I got through a whole month. It's okay. It's not like I like the job anyway. I got the blues. What am I gonna do about the rent? Food? I got the blues. What a shitty world. Don't give me a break, not even a tiny one. Ah, take that, bin. I think I saw a wanted ad. We're hiring. Not at that weird jazz club.
this place too far, but let's put it on the list. <sighs> Lonads. This place. Hourly pay is high, it's fishy, but... Weird. Jazz club. Cool name. Probably paying homage to Charlie Parker. Cold train and third. I can take the subway. Basement, 6pm, 2am. That sounds dope. It wouldn't be a place worth working at. What do you mean? Guess I'll stop by some other time. I'll make some cool story. <laughs> this kid doesn't know what he wants. Yes. Oh, you're not looking for anyone? I see. Uh-huh. Uh, calling about the wanted ad. I won't be paid for three months? I see. Excuse me. I could die? Wow. Bahasa. No, I can't speak it. I see. They expect a lot when they're barely paying a minimum wage. Might have been dreaming too big before. I had to compose music. Get ready to produce an album. It was more than I had the talent to do. But this is just playing at a jazz club, right? It's musical labor, like a regular job. Why isn't this the first place you called? Uh, hello? No, I don't want a loan. I don't support any political parties. I have no interest in matchmaking services for married people, and... Penist. You're looking for a penist. Pronounce that very carefully, Morris. Oh, uh... That? Pianist. Yes, we're looking for a... Pianist. Uh, Hugo, you put my number on the wanted ad again? Sorry. Let's see. Uh, can you come by the bar later? It's a... you know, right? Coltrane and third. Yeah, after you get the train. Go straight. See you later. When's later? <laughs> well, she hung up. When's later? This kid 100% has ADHD. Uh, I guess I can just swing by whenever. <laughs> Go shower. Alright. Just gonna change clothes. Before that, I should think about what to play. Put some music on. Why can't I go in the bathroom again? Just, uh, here you go. <laughs> Look at you, looking all jazzified. Here I go, off to work. Here are the adventures of Captain Chili, William Pepper, at the Jazz Club. Hi sir, what are you doing? That's none of your business, is it? He's gonna stand there? I'm writing. I can see that. What are you writing? I'll tell you next time. Are we just Ryan Gosling in La La Land? Is that what's happening? Afternoon tea, and there's a picture of a taco. That's the music shop. What are these two talking about today? What's the first thing you're gonna do when you go back there? I'm gonna go to my grandmother's house, beg her to make me some meat pie. I didn't make it home for Christmas last year. Meat pie? 
Fortier. It's made out of venison. Fortieri. Should I play? Guess not. Hey Alex, aren't you gonna work? I feel like I told you this a dozen times, but everything about my job is a secret. Cool. Now this is the 16th time. What are you up to? Soaking up the beauty of this city. In other words, nothing. It's when you walked over. Nice. I'll leave you to it then. <laughs> Bye. Oh, subway. Cat noise. What is that, the latest film? Space Pie. Coming soon. 15 amazing movies. So many movies. Bowling? Can we go bowling? Five stay vintage nights sunset jazz club. This one is a jazz club next to a jazz club. Jeez, We're not open. I I'm here about the wanted ad. Oh, let's see. Go see the lady over there. Hi, I'm here about the wanted ad. Oh, you're the one I talked to earlier, right? Have a seat. My name's Morris. I'm a jazz pianist. I mean, a jazz pianist. Ah, God damn it. Nice to meet you. I'm Angela. Um, should we talk? To get to the point, we need to see if you're a good fit, music style-wise, and philosophy, stuff like that. That's why I asked you to come by. It's not a music-related question, but can you tell me a lot about yourself? I've been playing piano for about seven years now. I went from bar to bar playing in a band with my friends. I also released a solo jazz piano album. You released an album? That's interesting. How'd it go? Oh, if you signed a non-disclosure agreement or something, you don't have to tell me. I still like 13 copies. Oh, um, <clears throat> sorry, I shouldn't have asked. It's okay. Is there a reason you're auditioning at our bar? Why are you auditioning? I'm unemployed. As you know, there aren't a lot of decent jobs out there for a musician. That was probably a dumb question. Okay, why do you play jazz, Morris? No particular reason. It's kind of like I got buried under a sunk cost in music. I did what made me happy, and that ended up being the only thing I knew how to do. I'm just trying to make ends meet. <laughs> Morris! Eeyore over here. Hmm. Other people said things like, jazz is like life, or that it's like playing improv on the chords of life. They'd say all this fancy stuff. Jazz is like life. It's a cool quote, but it's not how I see it. You're overly honest, I like it. Can you come to audition two evenings from now? Would four evenings from now work? I need time to practice. Okay, I'll see you in four evenings from now. We're gonna play improv. The show's gonna start soon. I'll watch a bit. Jazz clubs are all the same. Mediocre music to back up for the space of the food. Is he going to fall back in love with music here? Please, Morris, find the spark in your heart. Find some joy. Heal your inner child, Morris. Yes. Mm -hmm. 
Kleine Morris. Place your awkward ginger fingers on me, you depressed son of a gun. That's the piano talking, not her, by the way. Better than I expected. Oh, Morris. hours of sleep. I'm in a crappy mood. The auditions today. Gotta to practice one last time. Do it, Morris. Deep breath. Oh god, my fingers are in the wrong place. D F D F D F Jake. Oh. If I don't get the job, first thing I'm going to do is sell this piano. <laughs> Maybe I should have said the thing. I'm sorry, Maurice. I know that's not it, but it's still annoying. Let's get going. I tried, man. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I love the art style. This game is really cute. And, like, there's, it's clearly, I think... Um, like translated the English kind of dialogue and stuff. It's working, like it still works, and I'm intrigued in the story and stuff. Can I steal this car? Hmm. Um, but it still works for it, you know. A lot of indie games are made from all sort of different places, so. It's just very kind of unique. I feel like there are other games that do this kind of thing with the style and the walking and dialogue and stuff, but I get bored of them pretty quickly, but this one has something different to it. And it is just very chill. What's going on in their life today? a month left. Yep, a month. Means it'll be at least winter till you're back. Yeah, it won't be that long. Loves me an indie story. Kind of little misfortune vibes. Yeah, kind of like with um, how that's also, you feel like uh, turning the pages of a book as you play the game and kind of the art style and stuff. Wow. Jazz, jazz, jazz. Ah, the big city, see? Downtown or uptown? A taco hot dog? Can't go wrong with that combo. Oh, a pretty old cocktail bar. Feels like the 1920s in here. Back when swing jazz was popular. your life, Morris. Why are you stopping? 
Do you know how to teach school kids? Of course. I won an award at a tournament. That kind of stuff's a piece of cake. Good to know. You know there's an elementary school teacher on the outskirts of this neighborhood? <laughs> Dude, that's so oddly specific. Did you know there's an elementary school on the outskirts of this neighborhood? Uh, sure. Go and open a piano school there. Oh. What are you talking about? Saying you'd be better off teaching kids how to read music. <gasps> Savage. You can't even read the mood of the music. How are you supposed to play jazz? <laughs> you old ass loser! You think you can talk to me like that? You're just nobody playing at this dumpy jazz club. Get out of here. <laughs> Imagine seeing that before you auditioned. Uh, are you here for the audition? I guess. Sit, let's get started. Oh god. I know you've been informed, but all you need to do is follow our lead. Ready? I've got a bad feeling about this. I can't mess up this one. I can't make a mistake. If I mess up... Okay, right? Looks like you're really nervous. Let's try again. <sighs> Let him go. If he's this nervous when we're the only ones here, how's he supposed to play in front of an audience? We're getting a lot of weirdos in here today. I'll go. Morris! Play the piano, Morris! Oh, he had a little panic attack. Morris, it's okay. Buddy. Wait, wait. Let's give it one more try. I had stage fright in the beginning and I got over it, right? If he ruins our set, you're willing to take the blame? We haven't even heard him play. Let's think about it after he plays. He's so scared he can't hit a note. What more is there to listen to? Then should we just hire a pop pianist? Or a kid that doesn't even know what chords are? Even when our, when our profits are taking a dive? We ruin even one performance, sales are gonna fall even more. Then why don't you go get Selena back? Who's the one that made a perfectly good pianist up and leave? Let's give it a try. Just one. Angela, this is the last time I'm doing you a favor. Hey, get it together, get ready, we're going again. You gotta do a good job or I'll be embarrassed. Alright, make it about you and heat the pressure on. I'm sitting here sweating. I'll do what I can. Come on, Morris. You got this, Bubba. videos on the screen to go on another adventure with me right now and I will see you in the next video.